Welcome, KSL Gang. welcome ksl gang today i'm gonna share with you guys what i picked up during the bath and body works select 495 moisturizer sale it says for a limited time now usually when it's two days it'll say two days only so maybe through the whole weekend no coupon code needed so if you have a coupon you can use it but i feel like the 495 was a pretty good deal and i don't want to use my coupons on this i know something else going to come up that i want to use it on so if you have one it'll bring them down to like three dollars and 96 cents which is an even better deal i was really good i only picked up six items i also want to share some more moisturizers lotions and body butters that i picked up on a tiktok shop from small businesses also some shower gels i got from walmart not too long ago that i think would be great for the summer okay let's jump in so i got the tropic delic body lotion and body butter i got the lotion from my mom she haven't tried it but i know she'll love this scent this is definitely more of her scent style but i do enjoy that it is a nice perfumey scent and it's very lasting i was surprised that the tropic delic was not a glotion it just seemed like they would have made this one to a glotion but i'm glad that it's just a regular body butter it seems like the lotion is actually a bit stronger than a body butter but this would have been really nice in an actual body oil and next i got calypso clementine body butter i love calypso clementine it's such a real smelling citrus fruit this is going to be really nice during the summer to layer with other type of citrus and fruity different scents to layer with i love this one so much i was gonna double up on this butter but i said nope we're gonna keep it at one because i already have the body lotion to it and a travel size body cream next i got two of the coco shea butter body oil great deal these run 20 dollars each i have one but it's halfway gone this is just a really nice everyday body oil the scent is nice and subtle but it's just nice for layering and it's not a heavy oil just nice for a daily wear and the last thing from the moisturizer sale i got the rose and vanilla body and massage oil i did pick up the lotion from one of the last sales i think it was just a body care sale and this is not too strong either it's a nice subtle scent i do have other rose body oils i have a soothing house vanilla and rose which is a sweet vanilla and a subtle rose fragrance i also have the rose water oil from victoria's secret on the pink side that's all i picked up from the 495 sale so i'm gonna move on to some body washes i got at walmart I got these two soft soap body washes and I think these would be really great for summer to do some good layering combos and these say limited edition I don't know if these were out last year I believe there was another one in this collection I got the Bali Bliss which is a peach and a gardenia scent and Pacific Sunset which is coconut and lime so I just think these are make a perfect addition to add to my summer shower routines next I got the Dial Exfoliate and Restore Body Wash Cocoa Butter and Orange Extract it's smells like a cream circle it smells very creamy and i think this would pair really good with calypso clementine moving on to the tiktok shop i got a couple of things from savvy beauty i got their pineapple mango wilt body butter and the pineapple mango body scrub i've been trying to get my hands on this body butter for the longest i missed out twice as soon as she restocks it sells out so i'm like it has to be popping when i got this one i had one scent in mind to pair it with which is the bath and body works real pineapple mango mango i'm like i just know this butter will go perfect with that so when i tried this one from savvy beauty it's a sugared candy pineapple mango like with that glass crystal sugar on top of course when i paired it with real pineapple mango it was perfect i mean absolutely perfect together you'll definitely see this in the upcoming summer layering video and that butter is nice and creamy it's fluffy very moisturizing i haven't used the scrub yet but i definitely test out that butter and next from shop stunner shades i've been seeing these body lotions for the longest on there they are super eye-catching i kept getting ads for it and i followed and then the lotions just look so good so i got fruity rainbow which smells exactly like fruit loops which i've been obsessed with body care products that smells like fruit loops you're gonna see strawberry cheesecake smells exactly like that mango coconut which smells really good i want to try the gummy bear that looks really good the green apple they had have not came back in stock for so long so 
I'm just waiting on that whenever it comes back. Next from Rodine Creations, which I talked about a little bit in a previous video. Of course, I got everything in Fruit Loops, the body lotion, the body butter, and the body oil. One of the most authentic Fruit Loops scents. All of these are super fragrant. I mean, strong scents. It's a heavy Fruit Loops scent. It smells delicious. It smells creamy and citrus, just like Fruit Loops with the added milk. On top of that, the products are really nice. They feel really good on my skin. Next, I got the Amina Fruit Loops bundle. These are other products I've been seeing a while on TikTok. And I know you can get these at Marshalls and TJ Maxx. I never tried any of Amina products. When I saw the Fruit Loop bundle, I was sold. But I actually got this one from the direct website. They do have a TikTok shop. I got like 15% off for this bundle. So that was like $8 per product, which was pretty nice. So it comes with the Fruit Loop cleansing foam, the body butter, sugar polish, the lip gloss. And that lip gloss is a jumbo. And it's like a pinky sparkly color. Have not tried it yet. And I was most excited about the body oil. I actually just got this in the mail today. I was surprised. It came like in two days. So I did try out the body oil and the body butter. Just with those two, it's still on me really, really strong. That was a good three half hours ago. And it seemed like I just applied it. It did leave a shine on my arm. Not like a greasy feeling, but it's just like a shine once you rub it in really good. I think I'm going to try the whole bundle together tonight. The last I want to show you guys is the Canvas Beauty Body Glaze. She had two new releases during Valentine's, which is the Caramel Creme Brulee and the Red Velvet. So I had these for a little while. The Caramel Creme, it smells like caramel candy, like very rich and decadent. Definitely had a strong scent to it. The Red Velvet is really nice. It's like I got like a cream cheese type of scent or buttercream. I'm not getting too much of a chocolate scent, maybe hints of it because you know, Red Velvet, it's just chocolate cake with red dye, but it's still a really nice one. Okay guys, that's going to include everything I got from the Bath and Body Works sale and some more purchases from small businesses on TikTok. I told y'all this year, I'll be getting a lot more products from small businesses, which is why I haven't been doing too much shopping at Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret. I've been trying out other products and other brands because it is way more out there. Let me know if you participated and what did you pick up? If you haven't not already, subscribe and join the KSL game. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Hey KSL gang, if you love cooking and watching cooking videos and super easy recipes, make sure you check out my main channel in Kiki's Kitchen. I'll see you over there.